When you finish writing your six sentences, we are going to take a picture. You're going to take a picture of this part because I want to check this. Here, these two sentences. And here, your six sentences. So if you can't write in this part, you can write in another piece of paper and then you take a picture. So I want the picture from this part because I want to check this and this and then another picture with your six sentences. Okay, don't forget to send your pictures. And now we are going to the page number. What number says it? This here, 102. So please go to 102. Oh, here, we have filling out forms. Filling out. The word fill is llenar in Spanish. Pero fill out es completar. O sea, llenar todo, completarlo. Forms in Spanish es formularios. An application form. Application no es aplicación, es postular. Un formulario para postular, un formulario de postulación. An application form. So here you have Lena's application. So she's Lena Prentice. So you are going to use the information to talk about Lena. So what are you going to do? You're going to send an audio talking about Lena. For example, her name's Lena. Her name's Lena. She married. So, acá vemos que es señorita. Entonces decimos, her name's Lena. She isn't married. She's, tiene que sacar la cuenta, years old. She's Australian. She is from Chicago, her email address, so you give all the information. Use these expressions, usen estas expresiones, y tienen que agregar más expresiones para poder completar toda la información sobre ella. ¿no? Pueden repetir el she, el she isn't, o she has, o she likes, incluso she likes swimming. Ah, aquí tenemos vocabulario nuevo, indoor and outdoor tennis. Outdoor tennis es el tenis que conocemos, ¿no? Al aire libre. Indoor tennis es lo mismo, pero con techo. Les voy a enseñar una imagen en el siguiente video.